Kim Hongdo was a representative painter who was active in Joseon in the 18th century and is well known by the pen name Danwon. His works vividly capture the daily lives and landscapes of Joseon people and occupy an important place in Korean art history. Kim Hongdo's paintings have universal values and charms beyond his time. He made particularly outstanding achievements in the field of folk painting under the theme of people's life. These works capture the daily lives, festivals, and farming of the Joseon dynasty in detail, conveying the life of the society at that time to this day. In addition, one of his masterpieces, Sansuwa, shows the essence of landscape painting during the Joseon dynasty, revealing Kim Hongdo's artistic talent. Choi Mu Seon during the Goryeo dynasty was the one who introduced gunpowder to Joseon, and was called the father of the gunpowder. His innovation revolutionized Joseon's military power, which played a decisive role in its confrontation against external threats. Choi focused on increasing the efficiency of gunpowder and developing various weapons. His efforts allowed Goryeo to possess various gunpowder weapons, such as cannons and arrows, which played a major role in changing the face of the war. Choi's achievements are not just weapons development. He founded Hua Tong Dogam to study gunpowder manufacturing and applied technology, which greatly influenced later generations. His research and development not only contributed to the development of defense technology in Goryeo and Joseon, but also laid an important foundation for the advancement of science and technology. Jong Dojon was one of the leading figures in Joseon's founding and his philosophy and political ideology laid the foundation for the Joseon dynasty. He was a visionary who designed Joseon's ideal social structure and governance system beyond just his role as a politician or scholar. Jong Do Jong had a fundamental influence on Joseon's state administration and policymaking. He advocated a centralized government structure based on Confucian ideology which became the basis of the Joseon dynasty's administrative system and laws. In addition, Jong contributed to improving the livelihood of farmers and laying the foundation for the country's independent economy by implementing policies that put emphasis on socio-economic stability. His land policy provided a stable foundation for the country's income while promoting economic stability by distributing land equally to farmers. Heo Gyun was a writer, thinker, and reformer of the Joseon dynasty, and his masterpiece, Hong Gil Dong Jun, made a huge mark in the history of literature as it was considered the first Asian novel. Heo spent his life trying various reforms amid contradictions and conflicts in contemporary society. He opposed the social status system and dreamed of a society where everyone could be educated equally and demonstrate their abilities. Heo also spoke out for the improvement of women's rights and the rise of the status of lowly citizens. And this idea was deeply reflected in his literary works. Hong Gil Dongjong is a story about the pursuit of justice and freedom for the socially underprivileged and raised the need for deep reflection and change in Joseon society at that time.